Following two breaking news stories at 11 first, two boys go missing, sparking a big surge. We want to get straight out to Joel Iwanaga, who's live in southeast Portland with the latest on this. Joel. Well, Ann and Jeff, the good news I can tell you and confirm tonight the dozens of officers and search and rescue crews from Multnomah County breathing a huge collective sigh of relief tonight. I've uh, confirmed that those two boys were found safe and sound following this seven hour long scare. Now take a look right now. This was the search staging area here along the Springwater Trail at 103rd and Foster. Those boys identified as Caleb Clem Nizzi and his good friend Michael Wright. Now I learned uh, from police uh, that they were called after the two 10-year-old boys did not return home from school. Now here's the disturbing part according to police uh, who met with the boys' parents. The parents told officers that the two friends were going to go buy some food at a local plaid pantry and then hang out at a local homeless camp after school. They wanted to apparently resell this food, these snacks, to the homeless. They were trying to raise money to buy a PlayStation. Well, nevertheless, a massive uh, search was launched, including a fixed-wing airplane, the Portland Police Bureau's air support unit out uh, looking for them as well. But again, the good news, both children found safe tonight. We're back live here along the Springwater Corridor Trail this evening, where police tell me they have no reason to believe that foul play or criminal activity was involved. Right now they're investigating, trying to figure out what happened to these boys. Where were they? How were, what were they doing for the past seven hours? We're live here in Southeast Portland. I'm Joel Iwanaga, Coin 6 News. Jeff and Ann, back to you guys. That